So the Council is on corporate communication strategy and I'm going to really emphasise the word strategy there. So it's for those who are really the custodians of the, the narrative within a, a corporate, a large corporation. Um, and they are very much the strategist behind that. So in this world that we live in, uh, a world which is very much a poly-crisis period, which was, uh, the, I think, the phraseology that they used in the recent Davos, um, that person, that communicator, is going to be the one who's actually going to be steering the C-suite around what their position is for the company, but also the interpretation of what's going on in the world. And it's also uh, the navigation around the stakeholding that's taking place. So it's no longer the days when it used to be a simple media relations, corporate communications, and that's it, and here's the annual report. It's a, it's a very, very complex world now, and there's an awful lot of stakeholders and a lot of actors within that, of which the, the corporate communication strategist is going to be very much the, the pivotal person in that. So the topics are going to be very, very varied, but they're going to be really driven by the, by the members themselves. And that's the whole point of the forum. It's an opportunity to come together and actually really say, right now, this is top of the agenda, find the commonality and actually find a reason with through the agenda to be able to actually have a chance to really debate it. So there's some obvious ones in terms of, as I said, what's going on in the world right now. It's, it really is the poly crisis period and it's long gone the days when you could have a little breathing space between each crisis, now you cannot. So how do you actually manage that for, for one topic, for example? The other one is, is if we take ESG, for example, it's, it's, it's very much it's around the environmental social governance. And again, on the communication side, that's a really important area for us to be able to talk about um, in, both internally and externally. So uh, just two key ideas. It's not a luxury to be part of a group such as this, it's actually a necessity. Um, and, and again, more so because of what's happening um, outside and the, 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 the emphasis on the communicating and the communications team internally. You need to be able to have a forum where you can go and talk quite openly in a, in a, in a forum which is, is led by an esprit of, of trust and respect and know that you can quite safely really talk about and gain ideas. It's, it's the old the adage of, you know, two heads is better than one. Um, so actually feel that you can actually come into that as a, as a council where you can share, you can, you can build on the different ideas and the debate, um, but you can also feel that there's something very actionable that you can then take back to your own team as well, which is really vital.